What's up guys, I am actually out of town uh, this week, but I didn't want that to uh, stop me from uh, making some content for you, so we got something a little bit different today. This is my parents' um, 31 Model A Roadster. Uh, they've had this for maybe a year or two. Um, like I said, 31 Roadster channeled. Uh, it has a 350 small block in it. Uh, triple deuce carb setup. It does have lake headers. Uh, has a turbo 350 trans in it. So you can see very uh, traditional style hot rod. Um, you know, it's not the uh, the rat rod style, and it's certainly not original, but it's a really nice, I would say, like 50s era traditional hot rod. It does have some uh, modern touches. You can see the modern coil and uh, basically stuff to uh, upgrade it for uh, more drivability. You know, it's got an electronic fuel pump in it, and it, uh, it runs great. It sounds awesome, and it's uh, a freaking blast to drive. So I want to... Uh, Get a little bit of video on it. It's uh, been raining here in Georgia the last couple of days, and this is the first day that I actually got a chance to bring it out and uh, and show it to you guys. So, so the interior is this uh, nice red leather. It is a uh, custom kind of made seat. The floor is completely flat in this because it's channeled. So if you don't know what channeled means, the frame rail right here. See, it kind of just runs straight into the body and runs straight back and the body actually has a channel cut out of it so that the frame can sit up in it so the body can sit lower, give you a little bit lower stance, you know, so you don't see the frame underneath. The other style is called a high boy. If you ever see hot rods that are similar to this but you can see the frame underneath, that's a high boy. This is considered, uh, you know, a channeled roadster. Has a original steering wheel but uh, it does have aftermarket gauges put in it. Like I said, Turbo 350 Trans. It uh, is a really, really good driver. I mean, fires it up. My mom uh, is definitely the primary driver of it. She loves taking it out on the weekends, after work, and you know, pretty much any night of the week that it's uh, it's not raining and not uh, too cold or too hot. Uh, she is uh, in this tearing up the streets. Right. So. Well, that's enough uh, talking about this thing. Let's take it for a ride. Guys, I know this was a uh, super short video, but like I said, I'm in town and I really wanted to just take this thing out and a little bit of a break from the rain we're getting here. And I figured, oh, you guys would enjoy some content about something a little bit different than uh, my same old car or motorcycle. So um, yeah, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video. If you have any questions about this car, let me know. 
Uh, we have a whole lot more classic car content coming to the channel soon. Um, if you're new to the channel, make sure to uh, check out my other videos. We got Mustang, we got motorcycles, we got all kinds of stuff. Uh, check out my website, classicoctane.com, for some swag kind of stuff if you want to support the channel. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next one.